Hi, my name is Sterling. I'm a 1988 graduate of Kane State College. Uh, I love this college. I love the students here. I've been saying for years that, um, for four years, that no one is more ideally positioned to sustain the future of Keene Pumpkin Festival than Keene State College. And I, I see a group of people sitting here that I'd like to ask them to stand up, those, those fellows over there in the black with the red shirts. These people are uh, the hope of the future of not only Keene Pumpkin Festival, but our nation. These are people who work as hard as the other kids party. This is Teak Fraternity. Go Teak! Go Teak! I just wanted to call attention. Okay, guys, wonderful. <laughs> Don't you love them? Okay, so the Pumpkin Dump Derby is, is an example of taking the biggest problem facing King Pumpkin Festival two years ago and doing a complete turnabout. We took the problem of smashing pumpkins and said, how can we use that rage energy and put it into something constructive? What was designed is a derby competition, and I know everything always sounds like a competition, and I'm sorry, but you take 13 teams, give them each a zone, you can clean 30,000 pumpkins in 30 minutes. That was a miracle. That was an amazing turnabout. What I think we need now is another amazing turnabout. I think we've hit rock bottom. I think there's been people in this room who, who have been squawking about these problems for four years, and I actually have this proof of that. It's a SWOT analysis. Everybody knows what a SWOT analysis is, right? Strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, threats. This is a SWOT analysis about the partnership between Keene State College and the city of Keene in regards to the Pumpkin Festival. This was written by a team in uh, 2011. There's not a word on this that has changed in four years. All the opportunities are the same, all the threats are the same. We are a group of really creative, really smart, really industrious, really exemplary people. That's why this Pumpkin Festival has captured the hearts of people around the world. We need to put those same people on this problem. The professors of Keene State College, including my personal favorite, Rose Pendanis, the Brain Trust at Antioch University of New England, those people know about substance abuse, they know about cultural issues, sociological issues. I want this filmmaker over here to delve into the problem and let us know what is a, a um, what did you say, riot culture? I gotta know about that. I just think all the answers are in the brains of the people who care to turn out tonight and all of, all of the other smart people in our region, and we can do this. Thank you. <laughs> just, just the point of clarification, we at Antioch know about substance abuse because we have psychology programs. <laughs> <laughs> Cynthia Chase, please work your way up, and Demi Denise Kay. 